July 5th, it's the afternoon. Third time I'm doing a one week water fast. The first time I was able to drop down all the way to 210. The second water fast, I was able to drop down all the way to 207. Let's see how low I can go this time. Last meal before my seven day water fast, I'm having some salmon tatar. Mm. I wanted to eat it with some avocados, but the avocados weren't ripe. So I'm not gonna eat, you know, non-ripe avocados. I don't really enjoy that. And after that, I'm gonna treat myself to a chocolate protein shake. Yeah. Let's see, hold on, I hope I have f***ing. Me, I don't have my almond milk. No almond milk, can you believe that? I did say chocolate shake, didn't I? How am I gonna make a chocolate shake if I don't have chocolate almond milk? So much for the chocolate milkshake idea. My son finished it this morning. I'm quite annoyed. So I gotta settle for regular milk. Better than not. Day one of my fast. I had a lunch, but I'm not having supper tonight. And you know what I'm making? A berry sauce for the family. Just got to the gym. Hopefully I'll have a good workout. I think I'm gonna train some chest and triceps. It's been almost 24 hours since I had my last meal. Slept great last night. Day one, day two, day three of a water fast is normally always easy for me. So for breakfast, I got some pink Himalayan salt, apple cider vinegar, put that all in my water. So I'm walking to the office and uh, I smell barbecue. <laughs> Besides that, I'm feeling good. The only difference with this water fast is I'm gonna be training a lot harder. Pilot. Just relaxing before I go to the gym. Just got to the gym. I am gonna train, I believe, back and biceps. So for dinner tonight, I have some zinc and some magnesium. Delish. I just woke up. It's almost 48 hours since I had my last meal. I had amazing, when I mean amazing, I had amazing sleep. I slept for about eight hours, didn't wake up during the night, slept like a rock, feeling great. I got a painter coming over to the house today, preparing the house for uh, a set so we could film our, our videos in a better setting. Hopefully in the near future when we get all the furniture and everything, so it uh, should be interesting. Aside from that, uh, gotta go to the office and make some money. Just finished filming a video today. I was uh, really struggling. I was trying to uh, pronounce the name of the head of social capital. Chamath Palapitya. Chamath Palapitya. Chamath Ha Palapitya. I, I, I couldn't do it. And uh, I'm gonna train later today some jujitsu, get my cardio in. A lot of food, not eating. I wasn't hungry all day, but today I'm starting to feel hungry. So some water was apple cider vinegar and Himalayan salt. I just woke up. It's been almost 72 hours since I had my last meal. I'm feeling pretty good. I had a good night's sleep. However, last night when I trained jujitsu, I could feel the effects of uh, not eating, just the energy level wasn't there. Training, I still train for an hour and a half, so I'm pretty happy about that. You know what's the hardest part about water fasting for seven days, at least for me, is uh, going up stairs. This sucks. Look at that, painting's almost done. To set up our new set right here in the living room. Can't wait for it to be done and we can start filming here. At the restaurant, gonna pick up some burgers for the kids. Hi. Burger good? Hi, Coach. Good. It's uh, nine at night. Gonna take some zinc and magnesium. Just finished training about an hour ago, so if I have trouble sleeping, I'm gonna take some melatonin. Keep you posted. It's been almost four days. I haven't had any food. Last night I slept really good again, surprisingly. The one thing I'm doing differently this time, I'm walking a lot less. The reason I'm, I'm walking a lot less in the evenings is because it's been raining every night. I wonder how that's gonna affect my weight loss, but uh, as soon as the weather clears up, I'm going to try and walk for an hour or two in the evening. So as I'm walking to work, 
while trying to plan my day, I was thinking of filming a segment not related to the fast, but my energy is really low, I'm just not in the mood. <sighs> It's Friday, end of week. You know what? Maybe I'm gonna go bowling with the kids later. <sighs> Stairs. Training hard. Losing weight. Staying beautiful. Fighting through this. Just finished training. It's tough. Train with one of my long-term training partners. Haven't seen him in a while. It was nice to train with him. It was fun. Energy is uh, running on low. Time to drive. Here we have Gordon Ramsay's Pizza, coffee cat. Here we have a hedgehog dessert, Australian style, and I'm not gonna eat it. Look at what I'm watching. Food videos while you're fasting. Not a smart idea. So I'm on my way to the cottage with the family. I uh, forgot to charge the car last night, so hopefully there'll be enough electricity, or should I say enough power to, uh, to get us there. Stopped at a supercharging station. Need about 12 minutes to charge the car. Little pit stop, got some food here, fresh berries, some, some, pizza. some uh, sugar pies, and some pizza. but a lot of fruit. And yes, pizza. Here we are, chilling at the cottage, enjoying a nice, relaxing Saturday. Paddling a little bit on the paddle boat. Hello. Hello. Representing Ballistic Barbecue. Check out his channel. Oh, look at that. Although this is gluten free, I'm so tempted to eat this pizza and break my fast. I'm home now from the cottage and although I'm fasting, I'm still cooking. Cooking for the family. Making a mango sauce, heating up some pine nuts. See this guy here? Oh, we could even throw this guy in, eh? What well, we can put? Throw it in here. This guy in here. Check that out. Look at this beautiful pesto. That's how you make a pesto. Killer pesto. Killer pesto. Today's Sunday, one day before I break my fast. I slept amazing last night. And you know what? I did not have to take any melatonin this whole fast. I think it's because I started taking zinc throughout the fast. In any case, no issue sleeping. I'm thinking of going to the gym to do some shoulders, then train shoulders this week and maybe I'm gonna go bowling with the kids because I did not go bowling Friday. Let's see how the day goes and tomorrow I will break my fast with you guys. I just finished training shoulders. Hardest workout I had all week. That was tough, especially hard when you don't have your training partners around to train with. So it's all good. It's Sunday. Tomorrow's Monday. Time to go see the family. Fasting. I'm always cooking. Always cooking. Look at that. Look at that. Oh yeah. I got my magnesium and zinc. But tomorrow I get to eat olives and avocado. Today I get to break my one week water fast. On my way to the office, going up the stairs here. Still hate going upstairs. I learned again some new things. Each time I do this, I keep getting better. Check this out. Look at that. A rip box. All messed up. Day seven of my seven day water fast. I'm about to break it, but before I break it, let's see how much I weigh. 203. Or should I say, that's 204, to be fair. It's been exactly seven days, and I'm about to break my fast with some olives and avocado. Same thing as all the other times. I know it's boring, but it's safe. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like. And if you're new to this channel, why not subscribe? Till then, life's all about wealth, health, and happiness. By being healthier, I'm for sure happier. And by being happier, I'm able to make more money. So come join me on this journey 
As always, I love you guys. 